Good evening. It is Saturday, March 25th, and I'm doing another drive with FSD Beta 11.3.3. This is a short drive from my parents' house. We'll probably do a round trip here. Um, just going to pick up some takeout for them. So we'll be driving through Coon Rapids and Anoka. Good job yielding for that car. That is a very, very poor visibility, uh, unprotected left turn where our visibility to our right is pretty much completely occluded until you basically get the nose of the car to the edge of the road. The car does a great job of inching out there and uh, you know, making sure it's safe to proceed before doing so. In the earlier 10.x builds, that one was very iffy. Um, and one other thing I want to say too, at least during the daytime, I usually do the, the drive home. We're going to do a drive home from here later today. Um, but that unprotected left turn, it's the turn is usually fine even at night. But what I've noticed is it will sometimes hop in that middle lane, which is kind of a turn only lane. Um, and then fix itself right after. So I want to see tonight that behavior was there with 11.3.1 and dot two. I want to see if that behavior is now gone. So we'll be trying that and looking for that later tonight. Great job getting over and immediately trying to get over to the left. So we need to make this turn lane. There wasn't a lot of room there. All right, so we're making a left turn here on the main street. Good job with the line selection there and excellent placement of the car after the turn. We stayed in the second lane, no jerkiness on the wheel. Um, had a few issues, one of which is in St. Paul with a specific intersection we'll be testing later this week where, I mean, pretty much every FSD bill up until, up until now, even 11.3.2, was making the, the wrong uh, lane selection. So the car would make, basically make the left turn, but as it was doing so, it would pick the wrong lane. Um, and sometimes it would you know, cut other cars off and whatnot, which is not optimal. So you'd always have to disengage. Um, but this time with this intersection, which is a, it's a wider intersection turning on the main street there, the car did a great job, very confident line selection and everything. So, and nobody was there in our, in, in our inside and the other turn lane to kind of give us a guide. The car had to figure it out completely on its own, which was awesome.
good job with that car cutting out of our lane there. We didn't wait a second more than we had to to start accelerating, so that was awesome. Kind of a wide curb out here. Let's see how the car angles itself around this. Very well done. I mean, couldn't have done it better. I'm perfectly fine with it taking a slower speed to that corner as long as we slow down in a confident and predictable way for drivers around us, which it did. So, and great job there at that this left turn here. No concerns, no excess of hesitation. All right, so we are at uh, Serums here. I'm gonna go get some takeout wings. <laughs> 